before Frank came in, I, I sat here just listening by the window. They left the hydrant on up the street. It sounded like rain. The cops came and turned it off. And then there was an argument. And after that quieted down, some kids came by and sat on Mr. Greenberg's stoop for a while. Played the radio. And an ambulance pulled in over at the hospital. And two cats were calling to each other behind the garage. And I thought, those are the sounds I've heard nearly every summer night of my life. They're the same. And the shadow on the wall from the street lamp is the same. And I can be three years old in the big iron bed in the corner. Oh, it's all in my head. It's all part of who I am. And tomorrow it'll be gone. All those nights. And the sounds will be gone. Mary Ryan will be gone. And none of us ever coming back again. And Mama, it hurts. I just can't bear to let go. Sounds to me like what you're letting go of is something good, no? Yes. Oh. Here. Come. Like you used to when you were little. Hmm? Come. I don't know what to say to you, darling. Oh, no. Changing and learning and letting go. It's all painful. Growing up is painful. Loving is painful. But there's one thing you can say about pain. When you're feeling it, you know you're alive. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Anyway, and there's one thing you're wrong about. Hmm. What's been is the child you are and the woman you are. We'll always be here in this house. As long as those of us that love you are here. Hmm? And now, when it comes to climbing and letting go, there's nobody that ever climbed a ladder that didn't let go again <laughs> and again. Hmm? Oh. You believe you love Jack, and Jack loves you, right? Uh-huh. Huh? And you know that all your sisters and brothers love you, hmm? Yeah. And your father and I love you? Yes, and God loves you. <laughs> well, then. don't be afraid, darling. Don't be afraid.